the the two main errors would be access to apps, so checking why a user isn't seeing an app, and then validation, so if a user can't validate. Um, so uh, for that, that's where the slides can really come in handy as a reference down the line. So um, the easiest thing to try is click retry, but then the two main things for validation is checking the internet connection and checking the apps anywhere client. And then, uh, you know, oops, I chose the wrong one. Uh, this is how you can uh, get around that. And then some different things to check as well, making sure they're accepting the browser prompt. Try a different browser, make sure the Apps Anywhere service is OK. And then this one, uh, this slide is useful for your access to apps as well. Um, this other one is similar to validation in that if you get an app unable to launch, if you validate OK and you're seeing apps OK, it's, uh, it's probably not an Apps Anywhere issue. It's probably the delivery method being used, such as cloud paging. Uh, and the second half of the training is all about how we troubleshoot cloud paging. Um, so if you get a problem launching an app, uh, the main thing Apps Anywhere wise is just to make sure they're, they're accepting that browser prompt. Uh, if you ever, uh, if you follow all those steps and you're still having a problem with validating or something else, um, there's a log file for the Apps Anywhere clients. At that point, I would say it would be time to escalate and, and dig out the log and see maybe what it could be complaining about. Um, but those troubleshooting steps should cover you for uh, a lot of the, pretty much all the issues that that you might run into for users. But there's always anomalies. so. If you ever have to escalate with a log file, just these are the useful details uh, for us. Um, and that's pretty much it.